Hi, teacher. Hello, good evening. How are you? Good evening. I'm fine because I am very well. Nice. Nice to hear that. I tried to, I tried to enter uh, two minutes ago. I saw that only participate, but I thought it was <laughs> bad. Uh, I asked someone, what is today? And said, uh, other people said me, uh, it's Friday. No, 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 no. It's <laughs> Wednesday. <laughs> I try again and I see you again. I see you right now. Yeah, people are losing their minds. I mean, yeah. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Jesse. Hello. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good, good, good. Okay, so, yeah, some people are saying, hey, today is Friday. No, today is Wednesday. Tomorrow is Thursday, and the next day is Friday. So I don't know what happens. What's going on? Maybe they are confused for the situation. The quarantine, <laughs> the quarantine makes me go crazy. Yeah. <laughs> okay, um, so I have Rocio, Antonio, Jose, and Roberto. So... I my name is Jesse. My son changed Jose again. I again. <laughs> but all know all we are know that I am Jesse. <laughs> oh, okay, good. Don't worry, don't okay. worry. It's okay. Um, so uh, remember that tomorrow is the last day of classes, and that you have to finish with the platform everything that you have to do uh, on Friday. Okay. So that's what uh, Inglés Corporativo told me. Inglés Corporativo me dijo que tienen que terminar con todo lo que tienen en la plataforma hasta el viernes, ¿ok? Ok. Good. Let's see. Creo que a todos se les ha olvidado que tenemos clases, por eso quizás no se han conectado. La mayoría. Okay, so let's begin. Vamos a comenzar. Um, we're going to start by checking out the videos that English Corporativo tell us to show you, okay? Let me see if I have it ready. Let's see here. Here it is. Oh, yes. It, this is going to be, um, it is actually a conversation. I like this conversation. So let me just share it with you guys. Let's go chair and you have to go with sonido and everything. Okay, let me know when you see it, okay? Can you see the video? Can everybody see the video? Me, yes, I yes, can sir. see. Yes, yes. Okay, let's pay attention to this. Hello, do you come from a big family? Listen to Meili and Marcus talk about their family. I come from a big family. How many brothers and sisters do you have, Meili? Actually, I'm an only child. Really? Yeah, most families in China have only one child nowadays. I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow. Is that typical in Peru? Not really. A lot of families are smaller these days. But big families are great because you get lots of birthday presents. How many brothers and sisters do Meili and Marcos have? Type your answers on a discussion box. Family. I come from a big family. Okay, in this case, what I want to point out is questions. And these questions are in, in the simple present. So let's see the first one. How many brothers and sisters do you have? How many brothers and sisters do you have? Everybody? How many brothers and sisters do you have? You have? How many brothers and sisters do you have? Everybody. How many, How many, many brothers, brothers and sisters do you, have? do you have? Good. Okay. Uh, as you can see, she say, I'm an only child. I'm an only child. That means 
soy hijo único. For example, if you ask me, hey, I'll see this, how many brothers and sisters do you have? Yo les voy a contestar, I'm an only child. Soy único hijo, so, o hijo único, algo así. So, I have no brothers, I have no sisters. Okay? Let's see, let's practice. Um, Rocío, how many brothers and sisters do you have? I no, no, no. Oh, personal. Personal. Rocío, how many brothers and sisters do you have? Um, I have. Uh, I have um, three sisters mm -hmm. and three, you no, know, two brothers. Oh, that's a big family. Sí. So you have <laughs> three sisters and two brothers. Sí. Yes. Good, good. Okay, Rocio, ask Jesse. Um, how many, uh, Jesse, how many brothers and sisters do you have? Do you, do you have? Do you have? One more time, please. Okay. How many brothers and sisters do you have? Well, I have uh, two brothers and I don't have sister. Good. Um, algo que tiene que cambiar en la respuesta es A. Ah, no diga A. Ah. Solo diga, I have two brothers and no sisters. Okay? Ah, okay. Ah. Good. Uh, I, have, I have two brothers, no sisters. Good. Okay, okay. Yeah. Ask Rafael. Hi, Rafael. How many brothers and sisters do you have? Hi, Rafa. Sorry. Okay. Ha question again. Yes, please. Ha okay. How many brothers and sisters do you have? I have two sisters, no brothers. Okay, good. Okay, as um, Rafa, as Antonio. Mr. Antonio. Antonio. How many brothers and sisters do you have? I am have brother and no sister. Okay, I couldn't understand, but that's good. Antonio, mm -hmm. ask Roberto. I have um, Roberto. How many brother and sister do you have? Very good. I have I have one brother and one sister. Good. Okay, Roberto. As Victor. Victor, how many brother and sister do you have? I have. Three brother. I don't uh, sister. I don't, I don't have, have sisters. Sister. Okay, good. I don't have sister. Good. Okay, very good. So let's move on. Let's see what else can we do here. Mm -hmm. What about okay? The question is, if you have two sisters or one brother, a big family is for five members. Una familia grande sería de cinco o más miembros de la familia. Eh, una, una familia pequeña sería de tres personas. Okay? So let's see. The question is, um, let's see. This one. I come from a big family. So the question is, do you come from a big family? Everybody, do you come from a big family? Do you come from you a big come, family? Do you come from, you a, come big from a big family? Do you come from a big family? Do you come, do you come, come from, from a big family? A big family? So, si es grande su familia, va a decir, yes, I, yes, uh, yes, I do. Or, no, I don't. Okay? 
Okay, let's start. Victor, do you come from a big family? Victor, do you come from a big family? Yes, yeah, I do, teacher. Sorry. Okay. Okay, now, Victor, ask Jesse. Jesse, do you come from a big family? No, I don't. Good. Jesse, ask Roberto. Hi, Roberto. Do you come from a big family? Uh, no, I don't. Okay, ask Rocio. Rocio, do you come from a big family? Yes, I do. Okay, ask Rafa. Rafa, do you come from a big family? Do you come? One more time, please. Do you come? Perdón. Do you come from a big family? Uh, yes, I do. Okay, ask Antonio, please. Antonio, do you come from a big family? Yes, I do. Very good. Okay. Good. So let's move on. Vamos a ver qué más tenemos. So we finish with that one. Now let's see the other video that we have here. Oh, teacher, teacher, I have a question. Yeah. Eh, eh, la palabra family es, escrita family es, ¿qué, qué significa? Family es. Uh, sí, oh, families. Eh, es, familias. Familias. Famili yes. Familias. En plural. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Thank you. Family is singular. Familia, singular. Family, families, es, es familias. So, let me just go back here. And the next thing that we have to do today is quantifiers. Quantifiers. Okay, I'm opening it and um, I'm going to share it with you guys right now. So we're going to discuss quantifiers. Let's see. Uh, let me just share it with you guys. Okay. Can everybody see this? Yes. Yes. Okay. yes. Yes. This is going to be talking about quantifiers. Quantifiers. So let's see. Pay attention. This time we'll talk about quantifiers. When we don't know the exact percentage of something, we use words like some, most, a few. Stay and learn more quantifiers and how to use them. Quantifiers. All families have only one child. Nearly all families have only one child. Most families have only one child. Many families are smaller these days. A lot of families are smaller these days. Some families are smaller these days. Not many couples have more than one child. A few couples have more than one child. Few couples have more than one child. No one gets married before the age of 18. Notice how these quantifiers have an estimated percentage. If you want to make reference to 100%, you may say all. And then you work down the scale depending on the percentage you want to refer to. Follow me in this example. Nearly all women work nowadays. Nearly all, quantifier. Women, plural noun. So in other words, all quantifiers come before plural nouns, except no one. No one gets married before the age of 18. No one, quantifier, gets the verb. As a tip, ask your teacher to remind you about count nouns so you are able to use these quantifiers. 
Type in two examples using any quantifier you want. Okay, so that was talking about quantifiers. Okay, so quantifiers, we're going to go and check something up because I have prepared another thing. I have a PowerPoint to show you. So it, it talks about more about quantifiers. Let's look at this. Let me just prepare it. It is a PowerPoint presentation. Let me set. Mm, there it is. Quantifiers. Let me see if it's the one I want to show you. Yeah, this is the one. Okay, let me share it with you guys. What, uh, what is it? What is it? Oh, here we are. Okay. It's a PowerPoint, so let me know when you see it, okay? Here we go. Okay, can everybody see the, the PowerPoint? Yes. Good. So yes. This, this is going to be talking about quantifiers a little bit more so we can identify them. Let's see. See, two people talking and, it, and the, first, the lady says, can we plan a party ne for next month? We need more time. So let's see. That's too much stress. We don't have enough money. Okay, number one, listen to this. Can we plan a party for next month? We need more time. That's too much stress. We don't have enough money. So what does it mean when, when the lady says, we don't have enough money? What is that? We don't have enough money. Nosotros no tenemos suficiente dinero. Good, good, good. Okay, very good. So, let's focus on these questions. Number one, which words describe amount or quantity? ¿Cuáles palabras describen eh, números o cantidades? Enough money. Enough money. ¿Quién más? Too much. Too much. Okay. More time. More time. More. Que veamos que sucede. ¿Sí? More, too much, and enough. Esas son las palabras que describen cantidad. More, too much, enough. ¿Qué significa more? Plus more, more. Más. Más. Excellent. ¿Qué significa too much? Demasiado. Demasiado o mucho de algo. Yes. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué significa enough? Suficiente. Suficiente. Very good. Ok, veamos a la número dos. Dice, can they plan a party for next month? ¿Pueden ellos planificar un, una fiesta para el siguiente mes? No. No pueden. No. Ok, veamos por qué. O veamos lo siguiente. Okay, match the sentences with similar quantifiers. Vamos a hacer un match. ¿Qué, quieres? ¿Qué significa match? Traslar the, the line. Conectar. Conectar. Uh -huh. Vamos a conectar los quantifiers con las oraciones. Por ejemplo, number one, look. People drink less water than they should. Number two, there's too much salt in your diet. Number three, can I have a little sugar? So the options are A, give me a few oranges, please. 
B. Families cook fewer meals at home now. C. I think you eat too, too many burgers. Okay, vamos. Primero quiero que lea. Leanme esto primero. Okay, vamos a hacer una le pequeña lectura de todo esto. Ya se los leí yo, so tiene que ser fácil. Okay, Rafa, can you read this text, please? ¿Puede leer esto? Todo el texto, solo el número uno. No, no, everything. Yo lo leí todo, así que todos van a ah. leer todo. <risa> ok. O todos en el suelo o todos en la cama. ¿Cómo es? <risa> Démosle entonces. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh, match the sentences with similar quantifiers. Quantifiers. Quantifiers, good. Uh -huh. People dream low. People dream less water than they should. Number two, there's too much salt in your diet. Number three, can I have a little sugar? Uh, a, give me a few orange, please. Oranges, B, oranges. Orange is singular. Oranges, uh -huh. oranges, oranges. Please. B, families cooking, families cook, Fewer, fewer meals. Fewer, fewer. Uh, fewer meals at home now. See, I think you eat too many burgers. Good, very good. Next, Rocio. Yes. Uh, number one. People dream. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Start from the top, from the headline. Headline. <laughs> Mars the sentence big similar quantify. Number one, people drink less water than they should. Number two, there's too much salad in your diet. No, 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 no. Listen, there's too much salt in your no. diet. I see. <laughs> Number two, there's too much cell. salt. Sol uh -huh. in your diet. Uh -huh. Three, can I have a little sugar? Sugar. Sugar. Mm -hmm. A little. A. Pick me. No. Yes, give me. Pick me a few orange. Orange. Oranges, please. Yes, oranges, oranges. Oranges, please. B, families cook few, few meals. Fewer, fewer. Fewer meals at home new. Now, listen, listen. Now. Wait, wait, wait. B, families cook B. fewer meals at home now. Meals. Families cook few Fewer, fewer, fewer meals, meals at home news. Now, now, now. Mm -hmm. see, I seem do eat too many burger, burgers, burgers, <laughs> burgers, <laughs> burgers. ¿Sabe por qué me reí? Uh -huh. Porque de primero dice, I think you eat too many burgers, y burgers significan mocos. <laughs> No voy a pedir su hamburguesa en inglés, ¿ok? No voy a pedir mocos. Okay. No. ¿Ven como algo que, nos, que, que podemos decir, eh, nos podemos confundir con la pronunciación, significa algo súper diferente? ¿okay? Por eso el inglés hay que tener cuidado cuando decimos cosas, ¿ok? Ok. Vamos a ver quién sigue. Yes. Sí. Ah, yo. Okay. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um, match the sentences with similar quantifiers. Mm -hmm. Number one, people drink less water than they should. Mm -hmm. Number two, there is too much salt in your diet. Number three, can I have a little sugar? Yes. A letter eight, give me a few oranges, please. Uh -huh. 
letter P. Families cook fewer meals at home now. Yes. Letter C. I think you eat too many burgers. <laughs> yeah. Very okay. Good. Okay, only one thing. Only one okay. thing, yes. It's um, when you're saying A, B, and C, you say letter. Letter is cuero. Este mm -hmm. es letter. Doble Le letter. 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 Ajá, letter. Es okay. Letter okay. es cuero y letter es letra. ¿Ok? Ay, yo, yo digo cuero. Ajá, cuero. Okay. Le ¿Dónde está el cuero? Ah, <laughs> don't worry. Letter. Ok, very good. Ok, thank you. Ok, next um, goes, después de Jesse, ¿quién va? Antonio. No entiendo qué es lo que es. Antonio, you need to read everything from here up to here. Excuse me, teacher. Yeah. Um, I can hear, uh, I cannot hear um, your class, teacher. Why? You're listening to me right now. You're answering. Me está contestando, significa que sí está escuchando. Um, yet now. Okay. Uh, okay, maybe he's having trouble. Okay, let's see who's back to the question. Uh, everybody's reading the whole thing. Everybody's reading everything here. But um, don't worry, you, you're having trouble, so let me take somebody else. Or or let's finish with this. Let's finish. Okay. Let's see next. So we're going to do the matching. Let's see. Lick. People drink less water than they should. Family cook fewer meals at home now. So, because match the sentence with dissimilar quantifier. No es que pegara el significado con algo del significado, sino que en los quantifiers. El quantifier de este es less y este quantifier es fewer. Less significa menos y fewer significa menos también. So, mm -hmm. lo mismo casi. Vamos a ver el número dos. There's too much salt in your diet. I think you eat too many burgers. Too much mm -hmm. significa mucho de algo. Líquido. Mm -hmm. Líquido o, o incontable. Incontable. Mm -hmm. Too much. En cambio, too many es contable y es contable con plurales. Too many burgers. O sea, ¿cuánto es too many burgers? Para ustedes, ¿cuánto sería too many burgers? Muchas. No, un número, denme un número. Ah, cuatro, cinco. Ok, yo digo que diez. Diez serían Ajá. muchas. Too many. Porque yo, cuando comía hamburguesas, me comía... Hasta seis en un, 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 bueno. un solo día. I think you eat too many burgers, teacher. No, I used to. Cuando yo dije, cuando comía. <risa> pero, pero después me hice vegetariana. Ahora son de vegetales las hamburguesas, es como de diez. Eh, no, tampoco. <risa> <risa> pero sí me comí. Está bien. Está bien. So, too many. Too many. Uh -huh. okay. Vamos a ver la siguiente. Let's see. Can I have a little sugar? Give me a few oranges. A few uh -huh. oranges. So, little, poco. Y uh -huh. few, pocas. Uh -huh. Pocas naranjas, un poquito de azúcar. Pocas naranjas, un poquito de azúcar. So, you see, quantifiers. Okay? Uh -huh. Es indicando, no un número exacto de algo, pero sí algo que lo hacen. Okay, let's see next. See, less water, too much salt, a little sugar. Everybody. Less. Less water, less water, less water, water, water too, too much, much salt, salt, a little sugar, a little sugar. A little sugar. A little sugar. Yes. 
fewer meals. Less water, too much salt, a little sugar. Less water, a little sugar. A little sugar. Fewer meals, too many burgers, a few oranges. Everybody? Fewer, fewer meals, meals, too many burgers, a few oranges. 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 Fewer meals, too many burgers, a few oranges. Everybody? Fewer meals, too many burgers, a few oranges. Oranges. Alguien dice orange. No, oranges. Oranges. Si hablamos de una, sí es orange. Mm -hmm. Pero si hablamos de dos o más, oranges. ¿Ok? Mm -hmm. Good. Moving on. Use this expression with. Estas expresiones, ¿con qué vamos a utilizarlas? ¿Con qué nombres? Things. Think. Use it with nouns. No, use ah. these expressions with noun mm. count nouns. Mm -hmm. ¿Podemos contar el agua? ¿Verdad que no? Ah, no. no, no. Es incontable. <laughs> Por eso decimos noun count. No count. Mm -hmm. Noun count. ¿Podemos contar la sal? No. No, no, no podemos contar la sal. ¿Podemos contar el azúcar? No. 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 Can you give me an example of other non-count nouns? ¿No pueden dar una, una, un ejemplo de otros eh, nombres no contables? Mostaza. Ma, uh, yeah, mustard. Another one? Mustache. Mustache. No, no, mustard. This is mustard. Mostaza. Mustard. Mustard. Uh -huh. ¿Qué otras? Sand. Sand in the beach. Sand. Yeah, sand on mm -hmm. the beach. Yeah, it's not uncomfortable. Yes. Mm -hmm. Another one? Rice. Rice. Yeah. Very good. How about that? air? Air. Milk. Meal. Yes, very good. Okay. Beans. Who? Beans. 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 Yes. Coffee. Beans. Coffee. Yeah, not uncomfortable. Very good. Let's go for the next one. Fewer meals, too many burgers, a few oranges. Use this expression with? Countdown. Countable. 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 Or count nouns. Count nouns. We can, we, can, we can count meals. ¿Qué significa meals? Meal es carne, ¿verdad? No, meat. Comida. Carne. Comida. Ay, meals es comida. comida. Ah, sí. <laughs> el desayuno, la cena, el almuerzo. Mm -hmm. So you can count lunch. Y se puede contar. Sí, claro que sí. ¿Cuántas cenas se, se come a la semana? Ah, pues sí, así sí. Por plato, entonces. <laughs> Me llega. No, por tiempo, por tiempo. ¿Cuántos, ah, desayuno, por... ¿Cuántos desayuno hace a la semana o al mes? Sí los podemos contar. Treinta. <laughs> Yo... Te alcanza el pisto 30, no menos. Yo desayuno, no hago ni uno. Si no alcanza. Almuerzo 15. y desayuno de una sola vez. No, yo solo almuerzo y cena. Desayuno. Ah, está bueno. Porque, por las hamburguesas que se comen en la mañana. Comida, comida. He used to eat. I used to eat. La, that was 15 years ago. 15 años atrás hacía eso. Me comía seis hamburguesas al día o tres pizzas al día. ¿Cómo se, how do you say año, do, año dorados? Uh, the Years golden old. years. The golden uh, years. In your golden years. Yeah, in my golden years, yes. <laughs> okay, so, moving on. So, remember that we use this non-count, no contables, con estos, con estos quantifiers. Less, too much, and little. En count nouns, fewer, too many, and a few. ¿Ok? Ok. Moving on. Continuemos. Ok. Compare these sentences. There isn't enough bread. Everybody, there isn't enough bread. There, there isn't, isn't enough isn't bread. bread. Enough bread. There isn't enough bread. There is enough bread. Very good. Uh, the next one. We need more bread. We, we need, need more, more bread. bread. We need more bread. 
We need, we more, need bread. More, bread. more bread. There aren't enough cookies. There, there aren't, aren't, aren't enough, enough, enough cookies. cookies. Enough. 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 There aren't enough. 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 There aren't enough cookies. There, there aren't, there aren't, aren't enough, enough, enough cookies. cookies. We need more cookies. We need, we need more, cookies. more cookies. Yeah, algo que extraño son las galletas. Extraño mucho las galletas. Ah, ok. Yeah. You said in, enough. 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 Mm -hmm. Ok. Enough. 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 Ah, ok, mm -hmm. thank you. Ok, check enough. this out. Wait. You can use enough and more with both count and non-count nouns. Lo que significa esto, podemos utilizar enough y more para los dos. La, lo que podemos contar y lo que no podemos contar. Ok, so, eso sí lo podemos usar, enough. Mire, dice, there isn't enough bread, we need more bread. No hay suficiente uh, pan, necesitamos más pan. There are enough cookies. No hay suficientes galletas. We need more cookies. Necesitamos más galletas. So, podemos utilizar estos dos quantifiers tanto con los contables como los no contables. ¿Entendido? Mm -hmm. Yes. Cool. Moving on. Continuando. Complete the table with these nouns. Bananas, carrots, or water. Noun con nouns. Count nouns. Too much. Not enough. A little, less, more, too many, not enough, a few, fewer, more. Veamos el primero, solo para que vean el ejemplo. So, now come, podemos utilizar too much water, not enough water, a little water, less water, more water. Todos. Uh, too much, too much water, 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 no, water, no, water, water, enough water, 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 water a little water, 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 water less, less, less salt, salt, more salt, more salt. No, 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 water, water, no, 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 water, no, no, water, water, no, water, no, water, no, water, no, water, no, water, no, water, too much water, not enough water, a little water, less water, more water. Everybody. Mm -hmm. Too much too water, much water, 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 too much salt, 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 too many carrots, too many bananas, not enough bananas, a few bananas, fewer bananas, more bananas, everybody. Too many, too many bananas, bananas, not enough, 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 Okay, I'm just going to do it because we don't have too much time. And what I want you to do is to practice. Let's see. <clears throat> okay. More than you want. Too much water, too many carrots. Everybody. More than you want. Too much water, too much carrots. What? Too many carrots. carrots. Too many carrots. I can do too much carrots. There's not too much, too many. Porque es contable. Ok, esto significa, ¿qué significa more than you want? 
More than, more. More than you want, ¿qué significa? Ah, más que. Más que quiere. Más, más, quiere de más. Lo, más de lo que más quieres. Que, más de lo que quieres. Ok, por ejemplo, si dice, quiero un vaso con agua y le dan una jar, too much water. ¿Ah? Eso solo funciona con la cerveza. Ok. En vez de un vaso, <risa> una jarra. Ok. okay mm -hmm. so that's more than ¿Por qué le da risa? Okay. Okay, so Le so recuerda so algo. 15 years ago. Eh, eh, diciembre. Años diciembre. Años ok. Ok, let's go with next. Less than you want. Aquí es al revés. Uh -huh. eh, eh, menos de lo que quiere. Not enough water, not enough carrots. Everybody. Not many, not much. No mucho y no muchos. A not little many. water, a few carrots. Everybody. Not many, not many, not much. A little water, a few carrots. And comparisons, more water, more carrots, less water, fewer carrots. Everybody. Comparisons, more water, more water, more carrots, less water, a fewer carrots. Good. So there you have it. Ahí lo tenemos. En esta tabla de más de lo que queremos, menos de lo que queremos, no muchos y no muchos. Ojo, cuando digo no muchos es contable y no mucho es no contable. ¿Ok? Ok. ¿Alguna pregunta hasta el momento? ¿Any questions, Frank? Mm -hmm. So far, ¿any questions? No. Oh. Dijo que no much, no, no many, no much es no contable. Not many, no much, yes, no contable. Good. Ok. Ok, correct three mistakes in these sentences. Vamos a corregir tres, tres, ¿qué? tres errores en estas oraciones. Number one, there's only a little milk. Is that enough? Number two, there's too much food. Can I have more pasta? Ok, repeat after me. There's only a little milk. Is that enough, everybody? There's, there's only, only a little, a little, little milk. milk. Is, is that, that enough? enough? Is that enough? That's too much food. Can I have more pasta? That's, That's too, too much, much, much food. food. Can I have, I have more, more, more pasta? pasta? I think we should eat more fruit. I think, I we, think should we should eat, we eat more, more, fruit. more fruit. There aren't enough time to finish the project on time. There aren't there are enough time to finish the project, project on, on time. time. On time. Okay. I want to buy less apples, just two or three. I, I want, want to buy, to buy less, less apples, just two, two or two or three. three. ¿Dónde creen? Analicen estas preguntas y dónde creen que hay un error. Avísenme. Number five. Number five. ¿Dónde está? Less apples. Uh -huh. Number oh. one. Uh -huh. Veamos, es cierto. A little milk. Cuatro. There aren't enough time. Aren't está incontable. Y time es no contable. So debería ser, there isn't enough time. En la cinco, I want to buy apples. Porque es contable, no podemos usar less. That That's too much food. Can I have more pasta? Decía. Pero mm -hmm. que decía, como él dice, hay mucha comida. O sea, mucha comida en mi plato. ¿Me podría dar menos pasta? O sea, quitarme del plato. Por eso tiene que decir, no more, sino que less. ¿Ok? Miren. Wait, wait, wait. ¿Dónde estaba? En vez de more, less. ¿Ok? Mm -hmm. There isn't enough time, y ahí tal. Esos son los tres, tres errores que había. Less isn't a fewer. Complete this question. Use your own ideas. 
what mm. does your usually have in her fridge? For example, I'll see this. What does your mom usually have in her fridge? ¿Qué es lo que usualmente tiene tu mamá en su refrigeradora? Okay, my mom usually has apple pie in her fridge. Mi mamá usualmente tiene pastel de manzana en su refrigerador. También otra cosa que hay. My mom usually has a lot of milk in the fridge. Mi mamá siempre tiene bastante leche en la refrigeradora. Porque yo me tomo por lo menos eh, seis vasos al día de, de leche. Pobre vaca. <laughs> yeah, I love, I love milk. Me encanta la leche. Oh, y really? It's true. Yeah, it's true. Ah, wow. <laughs> mi, mi, mi favorito es tomarme un litro de leche con media papaya, la mitad de una papaya. Every day. No, not every day. Uh, ah. like, uh, maybe twice a week, dos veces mm -hmm. a la semana. It's okay. Yeah. Okay. So, ¿quién quiere hacer el, la primera? Ya les di el ejemplo. Me. Okay, go. My, <laughs> my mom, my mom usually have beans in the fridge, in, in, her, her, in, in her, her fridge. Very good. My mom usually has beans, wait, 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 refried beans or steamed beans? Uh, both. cocidos or refritos? Both. Ah, both. Okay, good. Okay, that's nice. <laughs> Ok, ¿alguien más? Wait, no, entonces lo voy a poner yo. Ya que no quieren. Ok, ¿quién, ¿quién acaba de pasar? Rafa. Rafa. Ok, Antonio, ¿can you do yours? My mom usually potato. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Usually have. Usually have potato in his fridge. In her, in her fridge. Yeah. In her fridge. My mom usually have potatoes in her fridge. Okay, very good. Okay, Kimba. Jesse. My mom usually has tomatoes in her fridge. Good. Um, look. Solo voy a hacer un, una referencia que estamos haciendo un error. Estamos cometiendo un error porque la pregunta es What does your mom usually have in her fridge? So in, in the answer, no debería ser have. Porque es tercera persona. Has. has. My yeah. mom usually has milk in her fridge. ¿Ok? Mm -hmm. Yes, okay, has. Bye, bye. Really. Ok, vamos con las... ¿Qué, qué es lo que dijo Jesse? Jesse ¿qué? Have, ¿Qué? dije. Because I... I... Remember how. Ah, okay, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> Pero podría repetir la suya, por Ah, okay. Uh, my mom usually has tomatoes in her fridge. Good, uh, tomatoes. ¿Para qué? ¿Para, para ensalada? For, for cooking, for doing salt tomato. Oh, sauce. Sauce tomato. Sauce tomato. Mm, well, my mom ha usually has um, tomatoes, but for for sandwiches. I love mm. sandwiches. Okay. <laughs> okay, Roberto, can you do yours? Um, my mom usually has Coca-Cola, her fridge. In mm. her fridge. In her fridge. In her fridge. You like Coca-Cola, right? Mm. Yes. She loves Coca-Cola. I used to like Coca-Cola 15 years ago. Coca -Cola. <laughs> you are based, how do you say vegetarian? Based, um, veg, vege, vegetarian. vegetarian. You are vegetarian, ma'am. <laughs> Ahora le dicen veggie. Veggie. Mm, veggie, you are veggie. Yeah. Okay, so who's next? Um, that was Roberto. Let's see who's next. Rocio. Um, my mom, my mom, usually cheese has in the hair first. No, one more time, Rocio, please. <laughs> my mom usually has cheese. No, no, no. Look, look. 
Mire, mire la estructura. La estructura es, my mom usually has. My mom usually has cheese in the her fridge. In her fridge. In her in fridge. Her fridge. Okay, my mom usually has cheese in her fridge. Um, okay. But what kind of cheese? ¿Qué tipo de queso? Um, duro blandito. <laughs> no sé. <laughs> I like duro blandito. I like majado. I like majado. I like majado and fresco. Fresco, I love fresco. And also, um, what is the other one? Um, queso. Pita. No, no, no. Capita. Requison. I love requison. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay, good. So let's see who's next. Sí, me estoy dando cuenta yes. que tienen en, en su refrigerador. Ya me estaba dando hambre. Okay. But nobody has beers. Uh, no, beers not nobody good. Nobody said, nobody said the truth. A sick pack. I have a sick pack in my fridge. Okay, uh, Victor, your turn. My mom usually has an what watermelon in her uh, fridge. In her fridge. Good. My mom Delicious. usually has watermelon in her fridge. Yeah, I like watermelon. Yes. Yes. Yeah. You know what I like most? I, Marañón I, congelado. Yes, I love it. Uh, I love it. Uh, and juice. 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 Yeah. Yes. That's nice. Good. Okay, guys, um, let's go for the next. Do you think that you enough, for example, let me give you an example of this. Do you think that you drink enough water? Pienso usted que toma suficiente agua? Do you think that you drink enough water, everybody? Do you think, Do you think that, that you that drink you enough you water? Drink? What? No. Do you think that you drink enough water? Do you think, Do you that, think you drink that you drink enough water? enough water? Yes. Good. So, the, the answer would be, yes, I do, or no, yes, I sir. don't. Okay? Mm -hmm. Negative or positive. Mm -hmm. Okay? Do you think that you drink enough water, everybody? Do you, Do think, you think that, that, that you drink, drink enough, enough water? water? Enough, enough water. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's begin. Okay, Antonio, do you think that you drink enough water? Yes, I do. Good. Uh, Antonio, ask Victor. Do you think do you, uh, do you do you do you think that you drink enough uh, enough enough water? Victor? Yes, I do. Good. Victor, ask Jesse. Yes, do you think that you drink enough water? No, I don't. Oh, man, you need to drink more. Uh, Jesse, please. No Coca-Cola, please. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, Jesse, ask Rafa. Okay. Uh, hi, Rafa. Do you think hi. that you drink enough water? No, I don't. Ooh, you need to drink more water. Yeah. Uh, ask Roberto, please. We die soon. I know. <laughs> no. Your, hey, your thank you. Kidneys, thank you. Your thank you. <laughs> Pobre riñones. Okay, thank go. Uh, Roberto. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, Roberto, do you think that you drink enough water? Yes, I do. Good. Ask Rocio. Rocio, do you think that you drink enough water? No, I don't know. Okay. Good. <laughs> Welcome. Yeah. Our, I have... know your, your kidneys. <laughs> How do you say? Bienvenido. Yeah. Welcome, 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 to club. welcome to the club. Welcome to the club. Okay. <laughs> Man, voy a prohibir la, la, la Coca-Cola próximamente. <laughs> hey, change, change así como Google le teacher. prohibió a, a, a Mickey Mouse <laughs> o a Diana. <laughs> a Mickey Mouse. Hola, Diana. Yo voy a prohibir la Coca-Cola. Okay. <laughs> Okay, let's go to the next one. Do you eat too much meat? Do you eat too much meat? Come usted mucha carne? Do you eat too much meat? Everybody. Do you eat too much meat? 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 Okay, en esto también podríamos decir, do you drink too much beers? 
Ah, ahí sí se ríen, ¿verdad? I don't know why people don't, don't want to say the truth. I know, come on. <laughs> Esa yo. Ok, good. So, do you eat too much meat? Ok, let's see who's going to ask. Ok. Ok, Rafa, do you, do you eat too much meat? Ajá. Uh -huh. uh, no, I don't. Ok, ask Roberto. Hey, Roberto, do you eat too much meat? Yes, I do. Ok, ahora cambiemos lo que ustedes quieran preguntar, con, así con este, con este, eh, con esta, um, con esta idea, lo que ustedes quieran preguntar, ok? So, Ro okay. Roberto, right? Roberto, pregúntele a Rocío. Rocío, do you, do you eat too much pupusas? Yes, I do. Um, pero ahí hay un error, porque las pupusas son contables. ¿Cómo sería la pregunta? Ah, uh, do you eat too many pupusas? Very good, there you go. Rocío? Okay. Yes, I do. Good. Rocío, as um, Jesse. Yes, do you eat too much fruit? What? Fruit. No, oh, okay. Uh, yes, I do. Good. Okay, as um, who? Victor. Okay. Uh, Victor, uh, do you eat too much um, hamburgers? Uh, no, no, no. Do you eat too much rice? Okay, good. Yes, I do. Good. Okay. Yeah, I like rice, but um, Cantonese. Oh, I love rice. Yes. Cantonese, sí. Eh, Can ah, yeah. Sí, es de, ¿cómo se llaman estos? Um, la comida china, ¿cómo se llama? China work. China work. I love Cantonese rice. Ahí me encanta ese. Con, más con ese chilito que hacen eso. Oh, nice. When we graduate, teacher. When, when, uh, we, when, when, you guys when we are going to graduate. Yeah, let's go to Maybe China we can go all the partners. Yeah. Yeah, all the, all the class, you, class me. You invite class. us. You invite us. <laughs> I, uh, no, we need to save money a little, a little, how do, we need to save money a little bit. Así se dice. Uh, uh, we need to, we need to save a little bit of money. A little uh, bit of money. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, uh, for two, from now to December. Uh, yeah, since. Since today to December. Ah, oh, okay. Desde hoy hasta diciembre. Since today to December. Okay. Sí. Oh, hablando de eso, ¿ya les enviaron eh, la cosa que tienen que llenar para hacer para el siguiente nivel? ¿Para el no. siguiente módulo? No. Oh. Eh, y no, a mí me enviaron uno, pero era, solo me han enviado uno que es más intensivo, según explicaban que era de dos horas. Sí. Dos horas diarias, ese es el que está ahí. Los que no, no sé. lo tienen aún, tienen que contactarse con, con inglés corporativo, porque ya están dando para el siguiente módulo, para que se inscriban, ¿ok? Ah, ok. okay. ¿Ese es eh, continuación de este o es otro curso más intensivo? Mm, es más intensivo, son dos horas. Okay. Que, eh, pero, que el, el, pero el otro, el de dos horas, es gratis. Uh -huh. Es con inglés para el trabajo de Insafor. Uh -huh. Entonces, ¿ya no seguiríamos con este, eh, con el siguiente nivel de este? No, no sé. La verdad es que no sé cómo es que van a aplicarlo. Por eso digo de que ustedes tienen que comunicarse con inglés para el trabajo, con, con inglés sí. corporativo, para que les expliquen quiénes aplican a ese o quiénes van a continuar con este. Ah, y... No, no es, son todos yeah. los que se van a cambiar. Ah, y mire, teacher, y este, y al correo de ellos. De ellos, correcto. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Voy a llorar pero, en pero, ese intensivo. ¿Usted, usted qué les recomienda, teacher? Porque mire, así yo lo así. vería como un atajo para llegar algo más rápido. A, y sí, dejamos pero, este proceso en el que vamos ahorita. Pero le voy a decir que el intensivo es bien pesado. Y requiere, requiere... Yeah. Por ejemplo, eh, no, no uno de profesor ni la institución, sino que en SAFOR les exige bastante. Y si no cumple con los requisitos al final del módulo, usted aplaza y le cobran, le cobran, le cobran, un, eh, no sé, le porcentaje. cobran dinero, un porcentaje de dinero. Entonces, sí, deja. Y 
la cosa es de que ya queda con mal récord. Sí, sí, sí. Pero eso es igual acá. No, ¿Y qué pasa? No, pero, pero acá usted dice, Vos voy a repetir el módulo. No hay problema. Uh -huh. no, pero, pero allá no, pero allá allá no puede. No. Pero si también no, yo leí de que si toma... no lo aprueba y si es irresponsable, eh, usted tiene que pagar también. Sí, 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 sí correcto. Sí, pero... O sea, y si no se toma el curso este, podemos continuar con este. ¿o sí, no correcto. No, pueden continuar con este. Pero mejor comuníquense con ellos para que les expliquen bien. ¿Ok? Ok. Este, Mire, yo, teacher, y usted, y yo pensé que usted no Pero yo le estaba diciendo, para de aquí a diciembre, decía yo. <risa> no, es que yo creo que usted nos llevaba paso a paso. Así nos iba a llevar. Bueno, usted yo, mismo. Ajá. Yo no sé cómo funciona con inglés corporativo, pero mm. yo, por ejemplo, tengo de trabajar con inglés para el trabajo con Insafor. Tengo desde que inició, desde el 2000, 2003, tengo uh -huh. trabajando con ellos así. Entonces, sí. yo, yo conozco toda la gama de... de, de de programas de Insafor. O sea, uh -huh. he trabajado toda la vida con ellos. Ahora, uh -huh. ahora que estoy trabajando con inglés corporativo, ellos tienen algo diferente. Es diferente. Para mí es diferente trabajar así con, con, con esta es modalidad. Que, ajá, es que yo, vaya, yo tengo un poquito de conocimiento, pero no tengo tanto. Si se fija, yo tengo bastantes vacíos. Sí, sí, y, sí. Y en ese intensivo, yo creo que ahí voy a llorar. <ríe> Me van a echar. <ríe> es que, como le digo, es bien, es bien abrumador para mucha gente y, y aunque son dos horas pero requiere más tiempo para estudiar sí sí y, y, y lo que me he fijado aquí es que algunos entran a la clase otros no allá tiene que estar puntualito o sea no hay excusa sí me entienden sí, sí, sí. Y, y, pero y, por, y, por y, eso ahora mi pregunta teacher de que sí que usted que conoce conoce este los dos programas y bueno, desde aquí que nosotros con los demás compañeros que ya tenemos, ya venimos en un proceso, ¿qué es lo que nos conviene más? Porque el deseo de aprender más lo tenemos, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Pero tampoco queremos este eh, tomar un atajo por llegar más rápido. Y que a, le vaya a afectar a después. Exacto. Uh -huh. Ajá. Uh -huh. Bueno, al menos es mi opinión. Sí, yo ¿Sí? creo que yo también creo eso. Entonces, lo que, porque les digo, yo he trabajado tanto tiempo con ese programa que muchos empiezan y ni siquiera eh, terminan el, 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 el principiante. Imagínense. De, digamos que de 100 personas que comienzan el curso principiante, solo llegan hasta el módulo 3 y son 6 módulos. Uh -huh. ¿Sí me Ajá, sí, ajá, ajá, pero lo que yo no entiendo es que y usted nos va a dar una puntuación, me imagino. Claro, claro. Ajá, entonces yo, yo no sé. <ríe> y ahí este, es que como yo no sé si usted es el que nos va a la puntuación y ellos van a decidir, pero la verdad yo tengo vacío. Allí la, los que tienen la última palabra son eh, inglés, inglés corporativo. Ah, ya, es, uh -huh. ok. Ok, una pregunta antes de irnos este, es lo siguiente. Eh, ¿Qué les ha parecido la manera en que, en que han trabajado conmigo? Eh, porque mi preocupación es que ustedes eh, les falta mucho, trato de llenar esos espacios, tanto mandándoles trabajo extra. Yo sé que tienen trabajo que hacer o que tienen que hacer durante la semana o el día, pero me gusta que tengan ese, ese, ese material extra para repasar o para acordarse de algo que no vimos en la clase. ¿Sí me entiendes? Sí. ¿Qué les ha parecido? Yes. Sí. A mí la verdad sí, me, me ha parecido porque es que como le digo, yo mi pasillo y, y algunos pasillos que he tenido usted me los ha aclarado. Y entonces, ajá, entonces eh, me ha ayudado, pues y creo que igual me, me puede seguir ayudando paso a paso. Ajá, entonces yo siento que está bien. Ahora bien, que si nos, como grupo que estamos en el WhatsApp, quizás como compañeros nosotros, uh -huh, uh -huh. se nos permite que nosotros podamos interactuar en el WhatsApp, sería mucho que mejor. Claro que sí. Para ayudarnos claro. unos a otros. Claro que sí, sí como les dije, este, yo puedo enviar una pregunta, los que puedan ah, la contestan, claro. nosotros la repiten, o sea, cosas así. Ah, ok. Ha hablado, no texto, no texto, ah, sino que hablar. Va. Sí, para que, que nos ayude. Es, lo que me interesa es que ustedes utilicen el lenguaje y lo usen. Okay. Sí. Okay. Para escucharnos a nosotros mismos también y darnos risa. ¿o? <risa> no, pero si así se aprende. De sí, todo sí, modo, todos no estamos iguales. <risa> y no nos vemos la cara. Para corregir. Y okay. La corrección no es para humillar a nadie. Para que no. no. Hay... no. 
todos pasamos el mismo proceso. Ok, va. Okay. Todos teacher, estamos teacher, pasando. Eh, Ajá. Sí, lo, lo único, teacher, abonando a, a su pregunta, este, también lo que siento que podría agradecer en lo personal es la participación, eh, la lectura, y creo que eso también nos ha ayudado bastante. Excelente. Entonces, eh, Como al menos... Digo, eh, si utilizan los, los PowerPoints que les mandé, ahí va bien detallado. Ustedes pueden leer, pueden eh, utilizar también inmersión. La inmersión le, le hace en la lectura ella misma y ustedes escuchan y ustedes repiten. Eso es buenísimo. Ok. Ok. Ay, ok. Está bien, teacher. Gracias. No nos deje. Pues. Bueno, gracias. Otra cosa que sí. quiero, uh, um, que quiero um, decirles es que les comenté de que en la corporación inglés corporativo alguien de administración me borró la playlist de ustedes. ¿Sí se acuerdan? Sí, sí. lo dijo. Sí, 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 sí. Lo que estoy haciendo es tratando de subir otra vez los, los, los videos en esta, en esta nueva playlist de esta sección 5. Pero okay. resulta de que no me deja subirlo porque dice de que ya había visto otro video que se había subido del mismo material. Entonces no me está dejando subir todo. Sí, porque yo lo revisé y dice que no existe la lista de reproducción. Uh -huh. Entonces lo que uh -huh. hice fue que también les, 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 les conecté con mi Google Drive. Ahí están los videos. Tal vez ustedes lo pueden bajar para uh -huh. sus computadoras o algo y allí los pueden revisar. Ahí okay. es el okay. material. Ok, okay, okay. Thank you, teacher. No sé si pueden agregar en algún comentario de inglés corporativo de porque ellos dicen de que como desapareció la lista, creen que yo he dado la clase. Ah. Ustedes pueden decir en un comentario o algo que ustedes okay. obtuvieron el material directamente de mí, ya que la, 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 la lista de, 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 de videos lo borraron de ahí. Entonces, yo lo, lo compartí con ustedes todo el material. Sí, no, sé no y nos está bien. dando la clase también. Sí. Va, está bien. Está bien. No Eso es solo para, para, para cuidarnos las espaldas, que digan. Sí, no, está como bien. bien. Como la evidencia. Bien. Ajá. La evi Ajá, no, sí. y, sí. y ha estado ahí, está pues, bien. todo el día. Sí, está bien. Sí. Va. Gracias, oye. Feliz noche. Okay. Gracias. Muchas gracias. Have a good night. I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. 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 See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow.